back to the channel guys it is your girl Gina and we are coming in with this video on another protective style I just washed my hair and um, towel dried it or actually t-shirt dried it which is uh, what's being told that we should do as you can see my edges are just suffering and I think I know what it is guys it's not stress as I thought it was it is actually where I did not know my hair type. So we're going to try a few things out and see if we can get this under control. I just, uh, I'm at a loss as you can see. So that bottle is a mixture of all of my oils. And I'm just going to put that on the hair just to keep it nice and saturated with, you know, moisture. And we're gonna just apply that throughout the hair. I'm also going to go in with the Oldie But Goodie, which is my Blue Magic hair grease, and I'm gonna grease my scalp. So I'm gonna come away from some of the new things that I've been doing and go back to, to my other regimen that was working for me. So we'll talk about that in another video but for right now we're just gonna go ahead and get the style going because I'm trying to do things that's gonna give less tension uh, which I've already been practicing on my edges so anything that's going to alleviate any pulling anything like that on my edges I am for it okay so hopefully this style is going to be one that will work for me so as you can see I'm just gonna go ahead and section the hair into four parts and then just work from the back to the front so I made sure I was detangled and there is my friend my blue magic so I'm gonna go ahead and put that all on my scalp and make sure that my hair is nicely hydrated and moisturized and um, we'll get into the difference of the two in another video as well so we're just going to grease up the scalp and i'm just going to two strand the hair all over no formation no thought process or anything like that so i'm just going to two strand it and then go into a three strand braid at the end just to keep everything together for my daily wear. So here I'm just taking the, the hair and just doing like I said a two strand twist and we're gonna go down as far like almost to the end but not to the end and then we'll go into the three three strand twist or braid at that point and like I said we're just gonna do this all over the head randomly <laughs> through the style here I just kind of want to talk to you guys just a little bit the some of the things that I'm pulling out of my regimen are things like I said I just introduced to you guys and don't misconstrue I still love those products but until I can figure out what is attacking my edges I'm just gonna have to you know whip draw from using those things until you know we can get this under control because the rest of my hair is flourishing it's doing awesomely and I don't know what's going on with the front so I'm thinking that I may know what it is and we will talk about that at the end of the video so go ahead and finish enjoying the braiding process and we'll get there Yeah. Yeah. 
So now we're at the top and I'm going to, instead of doing the middle part, I'm going to go ahead and do a side part. So I'm just making sure that those braids are more to the left of my head. And then this is the last part and we're just going to do the same process. And I'm making sure that I get the sparse hairs that's in the front involved in that braiding process as well. So we're close to the end and we're going to close it out here until the next morning and then I'll come back to you guys so you can see how I end up wearing it for my work day. That what I put on the ends or on my edges, that is just the Blue Magic Grease. So I just want to make sure that I have some oils there as well. Alright, so we're all done and we're just going to go ahead and go in with our castor oil. And I'm just going to randomly go through of course I'm going to make sure I get the edges but I'm going to randomly go through the hair and just kind of make sure I get the scalp with this oil See you guys in the morning after I see what the back looks like. So I will see you in the morning. All right, guys, so it's now morning. I got my little beak on, and we're gonna see how this came out because this is my first time doing this. So it's not bad. We're going to work with it and kind of just pull the hair around and we're going to use an oldie but goodie again. I have to go back to my old gel, the Ampro Styling Gel, and I'm going to use that to lay my edges down. I still love, absolutely love the Echo Styling Gel. But until I figure out, like I said, until I figure out what is going on with my edges and what is 
making it go this way, I'm going to go back to everything that I was using before and see if I can kind of pinpoint what happened. Because when I start taking the wig off and not wearing the wig as much, my edges were, they were doing great when I was wearing them, wearing my hair underneath the wigs. So I don't know what happened. I, I just honestly don't know what happened. I started using new products. The more I was wearing my hair out, I start using different products. So I'm going to take, like I said, all of that stuff out and just start over from scratch and see if I can get this together. So I decided to go ahead and leave the braids hanging and uh, rock it throughout the day this way. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's another protective style, especially for my edges. So maybe if you guys are having the same issue, you can try this and see how it works. And I will talk to you guys in another video. Staying fancy, beauties and bows. Have a great day. Thank you.